Hey everyone, just a quick video on how to add uh, the Mantle Testnet as a custom network on your MetaMask so that once you bridge assets over to Mantle Testnet, you'll have access to those um, within the MetaMask interface. So first things first, you're gonna go to docs.mantle.xyz, go to the quick start section here and click developing on Mantle. And there's a ton of information about um, basically just how to get started using the Mantle Testnet here. So we're going to scroll down just to this connecting to Mantle testnet section and uh, click on the here link at the end of this first line of text to find all the information we need to add it as a custom network. So we'll click here and it's going to bring us to a GitHub page that has all the information that we need here. So next we'll go to MetaMask and as you can see I'm connected to Ethereum mainnet right now and if I click um, this bubble it, it's going to show you the rest of the networks that I've uh, set up here. So you can't see Mantle here or Mantle Testnet, rather. So we'll click Add Network. And you're not going to see it here in this list either, um, or if you search. So what we'll do is we'll click Add a Network Manually. And then we will name the network simply Mantle Testnet. And then for these next sections, we'll have to go back to that link we just opened to copy in the information. So new RPC URL. So as you can see, RPC is listed here. So we'll right click and then we'll click uh, copy link address and we will paste it there. Next is chain ID. Chain ID is right here at the top. It's 5001. I'm going to just type that one in and currency symbol. So the currency symbol is bit, but if you type something else, let's say you type USDT, it's going to give you a message. The network with chain ID 5001 may use a different currency symbol bit than the one you've entered, please verify before continuing. So it's basically saying use bit instead because this is uh, the currency symbol that you should be using. So set that to bit. And then the final optional thing here is to add the block explorer so that you can quickly access the block explorer within uh, the, the MetaMask um, application or Chrome extension. So we're not gonna find it here on this GitHub page, but if we go back to the documentation under this useful addresses section, you'll see Mantle Explorer. So we'll right click this link, copy link address, and finally paste that there. So once we click save, all right, so this is updated. And as you can see up here in the right hand corner, Mantle Testnet is listed in my list of networks. Um, and also in the Chrome extension, it's also listed as well, and I'm connected to Mantle Testnet. So now once I've bridged assets over, I'll be able to see those here in my wallet.